Hey my chickadees. Y'all welcome back to the back 40. It is happy mail time. Okay, I checked the mail today and I had this lovely package from Miss Hope in PA. And um, I was just so impressed with it. It came in such good condition. Uh, we've been having, you know, a little bit of trouble with the mail lately. Uh, it's not their fault, I don't guess. You know, just the way it is. But... <clears throat> Stuff hadn't been coming in, in too good of a shape. So, but this package made it all nice, neat, wonderful, and it felt secure when I had it in my hands. And I thought, ooh, wee, let's see what Hope did, what she sent me. So, on the back of it, you see it's got a pocket right here that you can put stuff down in. She put washi across here, some washi stickers across there. Um, and you can peel it off easy. She'd use a glue stick to put the names down. They held up, and I was able to get it off. Um, I was able to get off the extra stampage there, too, as well. Um, <clears throat> and then when you open it up, it's a little folio. And inside, there's a pocket here. And she put me some goodies in it. Isn't that nice? Look at that. That's sweet. A little brown bag. And then on this side, look at this. Look what she did. I got a uh, seed pocket. And then she made this gorgeous little, oh, got a cluster here, um, or a journaling card, either one that you want to make it. Um, this is um, a cute little envelope with a tie. Then you open it up, it's made out of book paper, it folds down, it does the three folds, kind of like the one that we did with the, with the planner. And each pocket has a little sticker in it. There's a sticker there. It's got a sticker here. Pretty butterfly. And then there's a sticker up here. It's a little bird butterfly. Isn't that cute? And then she covered this part up here. That looks like some Edith Holden. And then over here in the middle is a belly band. This was sitting under. And then on this side is a pocket. In this pocket, you put some more little stickers. Some washi stickers and a stamp. That's cute. That's a Davy Crockett. And then um, a little lace sticker, doily sticker. And then this pretty um, paper that she put her address on for me. And I thought, that is great. And I was so impressed with it and so inspired by it. I thought, I need to make one of these put my Happy Mail in so it will get to our people without it being so damaged since they're trying to hurry up and get packages delivered and the machine must be having some issues or something. So, uh, I thought, okay. So, um, if you're still with me, we gonna, I'm going to show you how to construct it. Okay, and if you are still with me after this three minutes, I love you. Let's just keep watching. It's almost through. I got two minutes. Let's just keep going. And then it folds down. All I did was, and that's what she used to put my address on for the Happy Mail. Okay, all I did, all, all I did was take a 12 by 12 piece of uh, scrapbook paper. You know, light card stock. It's not, it's not heavy. And then I wrote these, um, is this where I wrote? Yes. No. That's the second one I did. This is where I wrote your measurements down. So you can look. I put it on my guillotine. And I cut it down at 8. I folded it at 8. And I folded it at 4. If you can see that. 8, 4, 8, and 4. That makes this. Then the cutoff that was left, I took at two and a half made this pocket at two and a half I made this pocket and at three I made this pocket that goes on the back like she did and then I thought okay I must did something wrong because I don't have enough all I had left was this little this little piece right here so I got me a piece of scrapbook paper out to make my belly band in the middle and I made it a little wider to secure my stuff in because I like kind of stuff in my envelopes and I put that across it because I look kind of cute on the inside and then this one I did better. Um, I tried to do like she did. So I did I first cut. Uh, you first want to cut your back pocket. 
So you cut your back pocket at four. Then you cut your belly band. Then you cut your three inch pocket and your uh, uh, two inch, two and a half inch pocket. And then you put it on there and one side is going to stick over just a little bit more for me. So I cut this off of number four, which was this one. And uh, it'll fit there like an extra little pocket. So I was just totally inspired by it and I was not going to tear it apart to get any kind of measurements. We were just going to figure it out like this. And that works. And you've got two size envelopes. I can really stuff with some stuff. And then to seal it up, which I already have her sealed up and in the mail. But to seal it up, I put washi down here so she could take the washi off. I put washi across here and did like she did up here at the top and put the washi across the top up here. The back pocket, you know, I couldn't leave it unstuffed, so I had to stuff it up too. I hope it makes it to you, Hope. I stuffed it with some goodies, and then I just put washi across it to hold it down so the machine wouldn't pull it out of the pocket. So I hope that in the back pocket makes it to you. All right, um, drop me a comment. Hope let me know if your package got to you in one uh, decent uh, shape. And I appreciate y'all hanging this long. Don't forget, join the Happy Mail movement. There'll be a card up here, and you can also check my about statement. Bye. Y'all have a good one. Um, I'm having some computer issues, so uh, there won't be a uh, prompt for today. Uh, and um, hopefully by Friday or Saturday, I can get it all straightened out. I'm working on it. I hope this gets up on YouTube before, <laughs> before I get it fixed. Okay. Bye.